buddy. Unable to knock. Edo run. Here's Spencer Dinwiddie. Davis Bertans looking for the screen. The three. The sixth man of the year with the Lakers as Fox. Unable to knock that down. Here comes Dinwiddie, former Brooklyn Net. We got another foul. This one on Shemezi Metu. Years of working with him on the broadcast side. Be that a player, a broadcaster, or a coach. I've never seen a former player come in and. Point six on the clock. Bertons the heat. Woo. The whistle gets blown, so <laughs> Doug's on him. Six on the clock for Dinwiddie. Bertons. That's from deep. Oh man. They got a foul on Chemezi Metu. Hey, Chemezi a little bit confused right here, but as you see Bertans coming up to the top, the contest, and it's that right leg Ooh. is what they're calling right there, which is super close to, to me of that kick out that yeah. is not allowed this season. I felt like Chemezi was already planted on the ground. Yeah. Try my new $5.99 spicy cluck sandwich combo. Thompson communicating to everyone on the floor at the free throw line, calling out coverage is what they're going to be doing. Going back on all Harkless, all three defenders collapsing right there. I like it though, the unselfish play, just not able to complete it with the bucket. Bertans, Avdia, man, make miss lead. That Tyrese Halliburton has done consistently. That's his eighth assist of the night. Tyrese dishing out the dimes. Kings down by nine, however, Bertans catches shoot, cash. That's one guy you don't want to leave open. Kings players in double digits. And you're going to need it to continue to increase. You need multiple people involved. It's going to be a team effort tonight. You've got, you know, Marvin Bagley and Terrence Davis out and the health and safety, Rashawn Holmes missing. It's opportunity for the Wizards. Here comes Dinwiddie. Corner kick, Holiday. Wizards moving the ball, Bertans. 16 shooting, and that'll do it. The Wizards will just hold it out. Davion and Bradley Beal having a word at midcourt. How about Doug Christie?